KMC Fire Tracker. KMC Fire Tracker is fast and agile. Now let's have a look at the three major components that make up this unique machine. These are the 2100 or 1000 series base tractor, the tank unit with its many features, and the blade available with several options. Now let's turn to the KMC Fire Tracker tank module and have a look at its particular features. The tank has over 1,500 gallon U.S. capacity. It can be top filled and it has a large screened area for carrying fire hose and other equipment. Mounted to the rear of the machine we have a Wayjax BB4 high performance forestry fire pump, electric start and with a self priming feature. Also on the rear of the machine we have a 300 gallon per minute Honda fill pump for filling from remote field sources. The onboard foam system consists of a 15 gallon tank with level gauge and a foam blending valve to create optimum foam water mixtures. Also mounted on the rear of the machine we have an electric hose reel with 200 feet of hose. Working with the onboard foam system this is an extremely effective tool for direct attack or mop up work. Also mounted to the rear of the machine is a water or water foam mix distribution manifold. Water through this manifold can be directed to two standard forestry outlets, to the electric hose reel, or forward to the top mount turret monitor outlets. As we'll see in this small demonstration, by adjustment of the foam blending valve, Water foam mix can be adjusted to suit the job requirements rapidly in the field. Using foam supplied through an electric hose reel with a probe nozzle is an extremely effective tool for mop up work. This small demonstration shows how quickly we can go from pure water to heavy foam concentration. In field use, the use of foam is commonly believed to extend the efficiency of water by five times.
Water foam can also be distributed through monitor turrets if the machine is so equipped as this clip demonstrates. In the front of the machine, if they, you're on that type of an attack or holding action, uh, you'll notice that they have the ability to be controlled easily up and down, or for that matter, in a swinging action, or downward, such as this. Combined with the, the system that we have as a pumping capacity on this machine, we'll exit 300 PSI at this nozzle. That's probably a maximum, and uh, 50 GPM. There are two of these, as you can see on the machine. There are a variety of ways to use them. Uh, we use an industrial 50 GPM nozzle, fogged to straight. The standard crew working with a fire tracker vehicle is three men. Normally of which there is an operator, a deck man, and two other people who can work on the machine or on the ground. In the fire tracker is a direct attack vehicle. Uh, this proves excellent for us on uh, mobile attack uh, and a variety of other acti activities or tactics we use both day and night. The KMC Fire Tracker is, of course, the perfect vehicle for transport of water to remote, difficult access locations where porta tanks might be established. With a 4 inch dump valve, the tank can be emptied in less than a minute. This is a rear view of the Fire Tracker module showing the pumps and other components, and with the rear access cover open. And this shows the rear cover closed up and the vehicle ready for travel and field use. This view shows the fire tracker module installed on the 2100 tractor and ready to go to work. Now let us take a look at the blades available for the fire tracker unit. Blades are the last major component on the fire tracker vehicle. We have three choices. First, the straight dozer blade. Second, the four-way side-to-side -side hydraulic tilt blade. And third, the six-way hydraulic tilt angle blade. Each of these blades is available either in rake style or dozer style. This small demonstration shows the functions of the six-way hydraulic angle tilt blade. The six-way blade is a particularly useful device for uh, building fire guard and active fire suppression and mop-up work. Here we see a brush blade converted to a straight-edge blade.